Are you tired of cleaning your Dutch oven after cooking with it at the campsite? If you use a Dutch oven liner, you don't have to. These things are so nice when you're making cakes and pies and breads. I even use it when I make something like a meatloaf. Today I'm gonna show you how to make DIY Dutch oven parchment paper liners for just pennies. For most Dutch ovens, you need a 20 inch roll, but those are not easy to find. You're gonna find standard sizes that are 12 and 15 inches. I got this 15 inch wide roll at Costco. I'll leave a link below to one that's 20 inches wide that you can get on Amazon. The first thing you're gonna do is just rip off a piece of paper that's about 20 inches long. You're gonna cut the paper into a circular shape. You want the paper to go all the way across the floor of the oven, up the side at least three quarters the way high. I like leaving my long side of the paper a little bit longer because when I'm baking with it, I can actually crumple up the excess paper and use it as handles to lift the food out of the oven. Let's fold and create a pattern. We'll fold it four times. Fold number one is in half as a rectangle. Fold number two is in half as a rectangle. Fold number three is in half as a triangle. Fold number four is in half as a triangle. Now we're gonna check the fit. Place the tip of the triangle in the center of the Dutch oven. We're gonna cut it to kind of round out the corners a little bit. Place the parchment paper in the Dutch oven. We're gonna smooth it along the bottom of the floor kind of run your finger around the outside so it goes in the crease and then work it up the sides of the oven. Once you know it's going to fit, you know you've got a good size and shape. We're gonna just go into an assembly line and make a bunch of them using this one as the pattern. If you're making something with a high liquid content like a soup or a stew or a chili, you're gonna need to use an aluminum foil liner that's a solid thing that will hold all of that liquid. Otherwise, a parchment paper liner is a great option. Now that you've used a parchment paper liner and you've lift the food out of the oven, you're gonna see that there's pretty much nothing in there. There might be a little bit of grease or something. You're gonna just use a paper towel, wipe it out, and then put some nice fresh oil on it to season it up and store it away for next time. I'm gonna leave a link below to my blog post with all of these instructions. Don't let meal planning be a chore. Make sure you grab one of my free printable camping meal planner templates, it'll be in the description below. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so you're notified every time I post new easy recipes and camping tips. Leave a comment below and let me know your biggest challenge with Dutch oven cooking at the campsite. I'd love to help you out.